Hundreds of thousands of Serbians gathered in southern Yugoslavia today for a huge demonstration in Kosovo, a province where ethnic Albanians form the majority. Many Yugoslavs fear the resurgence of local rivalries could tear their country apart. In Kosovo, the ethnic Albanian majority resent coming under the control of the Serbs. In turn, the Serbs feel swamped in a province they call their homeland. Kosovo Albanians want independence from Serbia. The Serbs are trying to hold on to their southern province at the barrel of a gun. In Kosovo today, they've been mourning the deaths of 65 people massacred by Serb forces. The killing of at least 45 ethnic Albanians has now drawn condemnation from the UN. Serb forces now seem intent on removing any traces of ethnic ethnic Albanians from Kosovo. Their mission is ethnic cleansing. Every new battle empties another village. 5,000 new refugees. 70,000 have fled the Serb tanks. 260,000 displaced persons. 300,000 people are moving towards the borders. A defiant Yugoslav president, Slobodan Milosevic, shows no signs of slowing the violent Serb crackdown in Kosovo. The dangers of acting now are clearly outweighed by the risks of failing to act. We must act to save thousands of innocent men, women and children from humanitarian catastrophe. NATO forces went into action shortly after nightfall. Hi, I'm Lieutenant James Blunt, and this is the first installment of my video diary. Today, we deploy to the Balkans. We don't know how long for, and we don't know what our job is yet, but I'm going to get as much of it on camera as I possibly can. I was there in 1999 in Kosovo. I'd gone there with NATO. It was the Kosovo conflict. Good morning, gentlemen. Welcome aboard on our flight to Pristina, Kosovo. That time was a real chapter in my life. And we really had this goal and we had a purpose. And, and now leading a completely different way of life. You know, now I deal in an industry that can deal with lots of things that are quite fickle and pretentious. And I suppose some of those things just seem so irrelevant. In Kosovo, the issues were real. Um, and uh, it would be even nice to feel that again. I wanted to play a concert because, you know, you have a bunch of soldiers out there, you're away from home. It can be a pretty lonely experience sometimes. And just to have someone turn up and do something different for you is a nice break. All right there. All right. How's it going? I'm James. How are you? Nice to meet you. Right, nice to meet you too. So if I can turn up and do that for half an hour, it's a very simple job for me and a pleasure to do. red flag is the Albanian flag, Kosovo Albanian flag, with a double-headed eagle. I remember the church, actually, because we were protecting the church, because, um, because I think they were trying to burn it. I think the Albanians were trying to burn it, because obviously it's a, it's a Christian church, and it looks as though it's been burnt. <laughs> so we, you know, we'd have a tank outside a church try and protect it. Let me show you around the vehicle. Here's a machine gun, loads of ammo in here, 200 rounds there, 30 millimeter. This goes in the gun here. That's my explosive. We'll use that against soft skin and infantry. I was the very first person um, into Pristina with my troop. I was the first officer and had a, a troop of 15 men and we were the first people here. Thursday, 10th of June, and tonight we're going to go in 
to Kosovo itself. I think we'll move straight up to the capital, Pristina. We're going to be the first ones in. It's going to be very exciting. And this is the front of the British forces, or all NATO forces, moving in to Kosovo. We'll see how this goes. There's the last checkpoint. We're now in Serbia. There are the refugees waving at this. Soldiers, please welcome the unique, the fantastic talent that is James Blunt. Thank you, thank you. It's very special to be back here. I came here seven years ago. Bear in mind that I'm the one who asked for this to be some girls in the audience. So if you're a bloke, you've got to thank me there are some birds here. So I did, I did my job. I did my job. So I have been looking out for you. I don't know if you can notice. It's something I've never stopped doing since I, since I left the army. While I'm keeping time in a song, I permanently start marching as I'm playing. It's the one thing they comment in the reviews. He hasn't left the army, he still marches. <laughs>
Cause I'm 